Welcome back to my YouTube channel. Ladies and gentlemen, we are starting a new series where we are looking at investors from different countries who have started investing in Bahrain. And to kick us off, we are starting with the Kenyan farmers market. Now the Kenyan farmers market is bringing fruit produce from all over Africa into Bahrain. This is a shop where you can get any type of food that you want. Today we are going to take you through to see the food that they have. Let us know which country you're coming from and you're, you're a resident of Bahrain, which country you're coming from and let us know which food produce you would want the Kenyan farmers market to bring to you. Now. We will start from here where we have avocado. The avocados, she br they bring the avocados from uh, Uganda and Kenya. So we have the Ugandan and Kenyan uh, avocados. We also have the sweet potatoes. Sweet potatoes, ready, fresh, very fresh. All from um, Uganda and Kenya. Uh, we have as well, we have um, in, in, in. We have millet flour. We have millet flour as well. Millet flour is from Kenya. We have uh, beans. We have beans. Uh, what do you call these beans? Um, I know them in my native language, but you know, you have it. The camera will come close and you'll see all the produce we have. And then we have um, silver fish. In Kenya, we call it omena. In Uganda as well, they call it omena. I think buga omena. So this is dried fish from Kenya. It's from Lake Victoria. Lake Victoria borders between Kenya, Tanzania, and Uganda. So we have that. We also have uh, soya beans. Come closer. We also have soya beans. That is soya beans as well. Then we have the yellow beans as well. Yellow beans as well. Now we also have, um, by the way, Nigerian people, we have the palm oil. So you can come around, shop your palm oil. I think she told me this is going for 3.5 BD. 3.5 BD. We have from Kenya, you have Royco. Guys, you have to make your food full. You have to make your food look fresh. Not look fresh, just uh, fresh. You know, use that Kenyan sauce, Kenyan mchuzi mix. So we have the beef uh, Royco mchuzi mix and we have the chicken Royco mchuzi mix. And guys, my Ugali lovers, hey, look at this. We are here with Ugali. We are here with Jogo. Guys, you guys have to come and shop in this shop. You have to come and get stuff from this shop. We have um, Chica Chili. Guys, guys, you're missing out if you've not come to this shop. And then we have the Masala Chai. We have the masala chai, spice up your chai, spice up your chai. We have the blue bun, we have the blue bun, guys. Mm -hmm. See, you're not missing anything at home. If you come to the Kenyan farmer's market, you're not going to miss any foods from home. And you don't have to buy the big, look, you don't have to get this. You don't have to buy it. By the way, this goes for um, 1.9 BD, 1, 1 BD 900 fields. But if you don't have that, you still can make your food, you know, tasty and everything because you're going to get the sachet of this and you can make a meal. So we have that, we have the sachets. We have the Royco cubes as well, guys. There is no way you're going to make, to cook dal food when you have Kenyan's farmer's market. We have this as well. Uh -huh. Now let us look at something else. Kenyan's farmer's market is having also meal flour. I just showed you meal flour. Here it is meal flour. Guys, we have meal, meal, meal flour as well. This is very good for children. If you're having toddlers and everything and you need to make for them. Now millet. 
you need to make for them um, porridge in the morning. We have that. And we have um, gin nut paste. Gin nut paste. Guys, some stuff, if I don't know something, correct me. Tell me which country it is from. Because I am Kenyan and I don't know much. So we have gin nut paste. I don't know where that one is from. Um, we have the green beans as well. We have green beans as well. So guys, guys, there's nothing you are not going to get from here. Nothing you're not going to get from there. And then we have G powder. So we have G paste and we have the G powder. G nut powder. We have the G nut powder as well. Uh -huh. We have rice. This is uh, Bishori rice from Kenya. We have Bishori rice from Kenya. Guys, when you cook this one, it comes out one by one. So, have a, you guys have to come here. Guys, I am just telling you, come, come this way. Green grams, green grams from Africa. Guys, we have green grams as well. Hey, I am doing this and I'm saying you guys have to come here. And nuts from Nigeria. Guys, guys, guys. I know, hey, my Nigerian people, you love your nuts, grounded nuts. Here, come out here, come out here. Then we have um, black peas, black peas. Guys, you have to come here. You guys, you have to come here. And the black peas, this bag is going for 1.5, 1.4, 1.4. You get this one. Um... Then, of course, now I told you we have the yellow beans. Let me see, we have this mixed mixed millet for this is mixed millet and everything for children. All right. So you have if you have toddlers that they're trying to start eating and stuff like that, we have something from you from Kenya, Uganda, Nigeria. Now, guys, there is a food in Kenya we call the githeri. Githeri is a mixta, mixture of beans and corn this is hard corn this is hard corn from uganda have a look at that have a look at that this is hard corn from uganda guys there's nothing here that is not there we have the soya powder soya powder my people we have soya powder as well there is nothing you guys are not going to get here then we have another set of beans. I think we've, we've looked at uh, four types of beans now. We have the kidney beans, we have the yellow beans, we have the green beans, and we have this as well. We have these beans as well. So I don't know what you call this one, but somebody should just tell me what you call them, you know? Let me know what you call them. And then we have, these ones are called what? This one is also another form of beans, but I know they're very, they quick, they cook very quickly as well. Let me see what we've missed. Checking out, oh, oh, oh. we almost forgotten. We have cassava. What do you call this in Nigeria? You make it with it, you make solo. Yeah, you make solo with it. Yes, so we have uh, fufu. So we have the cassava flour, guys. Come check this out. You are not going to miss eating fufu. Uh, why should you miss home when you have food here? So guys, you have to show up on this shop. You will have to support our sister, Kenyan maize flour. Kenyan maize flour. So you, if you're not able to buy the Jogowan, you can always get the smaller one, the Kenyan maize flour. Um, we say this one is made directly from the posho meal. So when you have the dry corn, you just take it to the posho meal. And there's a difference between this and that. And I know a lot of people love the posho meal direct maize flour. So this one is from Kenya and is going for only 2BD. The posho maize flour. Again, we have another kind of... So we have different grades of the posho flour. But you can always come around here and choose what is your variety. And then we have other fruits. We have, uh, we are going inside the fridge today. We have matoke. 
Matoke. We have Matoke. Hmm? We have Matoke from Uganda, guys. Guys, you have guys, you have to come here and join. Thank you so much, guys. And, th and I am asking you guys to follow us, um, subscribe to our channel, guys. And if you have any business that you've started in Bahrain and you want us to come and visit it, you want us to come and allow people to know where your business is, guys, we'll be very grateful to receive your call. Tell us about your business and we will be there to advertise your business for you. Thank you very much. And this is Daring the Desert Media with Esther. Thank you. Kenyan Farmers Market is located in Hura, Manama. To get your favorite African food produce, you can visit the shop or order for delivery. Kenyan Farmers Market, bringing African produce to Bahrain.